Hey guys, welcome back to Pathologic. The game where... I don't know. The game where suicide becomes an ever, ever closer option. The game where it takes a while for this door to load, apparently. Now, I just spoke to the Bachelor, and uh, he was like, Go talk to Lara Revel. Which is over here. Now, I think there was some other crap I wanted to get done today, but I don't actually know. Uh, regardless, I think L brings it. Alright, no, that's not what I'm after. P, that's me. No, ah, yes, I want to look at the adherence. Make sure they're all still friggin' alive. Uh, who's Laska? Alright, whatever. Let's go, uh... Let's go have a chat to... This chick. Or whatever. Um... Lara Revel. I like, I like that name. To Revel! To Party! I wonder if that's like an assumed name. Because it's like, you know... Turn of the century. Is she actually a prostitute? It's not gonna let me go down this way, is it? No, it doesn't. I can jump, but it doesn't interact with the terrain. Can I even jump up on this? I cannot. Jumping is literally a pointless endeavor in this game. It doesn't achieve anything. It interacts not, uh, with the terrain not at all. Excuse me, Dracula. Dracula, ah, postmodern Dracula. Crap, getting kind of hungry over here. Don't like the drugs, the drugs, the drugs. Actually, they're pretty useful in this game. Alright. None of those are useful to anyone. <laughs> in the least. However, there's a food store over here. I suppose, I, I guess it's supposed to be a butcher because of the cow head. But it's all like... Here's your loaf of bread, motherfucker! I'm like, oh, okay. But I, I actually, I guess. My butcher sells me orange juice. Really, really delicious orange juice, for that matter, actually. <laughs> so I can't really complain. What, yeah. Step over the tiny ledge! My god! Your store is a mess. Sell me this smoked meat. And this egg. Buy some of my crap. You want some peanuts? Yeah, have some peanuts. Alright, thank you. Delicious. Where did I get this money from? Normally, like, well, not normally the last time, by this point in the game, I was dead broke constantly and falling sick. Well, maybe th maybe there's like a connection there. Maybe uh, by not getting super infected, I managed to save some money. Jesus Christ, Lara Revel! Your house actually looks like a house. In your face, everybody else! Aha! I jumped up those steps. Yes, usefulness. You don't look like a Lara. Okay, creepy mannequin person. I take it these are the corpses of Lara's victims. Whoop! Nope. Nope, they're moving, they're doing stuff, they're just junkies. My bad. To harm people ah, Lara Revel. Did the office send you? What is this like? World of Warcraft for people, for people who have a speech impediment? Uh, what are the stains in your clothes? I am son to Isidore Barak. My name is Artemy. Oh, wait. Oh, I see everywhere. That's blood. <laughs> oh, no. The bachelor has found out what tablets can help from the illness. That's good to know. Whoa, you look like you're on some tablets yourself there, sweetheart. Guess you like, like the people in your house. Is this one of those, like, everyone's a junkie in the house houses? I forget what you call that. Can I help you? I'm looking for Stark Reuben. It is your good luck that I know where he is. But what do you need him for? You want to take vengeance on him? 
What for? He threatened to punish you. He believes that you killed Isidore. It isn't so, is it? Of course not. So why do you need him? I am making the panacea just as he is. I want to find out about his results. I want to speak to him about my father's death as well. Uh, let's go with that one. Do you give me your word that you will never reveal this place to anyone? Can you swear on your father's memory? Yes. There was a fight at the abandoned warehouses near the factories. The citizens found the lair of the rogue Braga. His men were the first that went about cutting. Oh, cutting people. <laughs> Ruben has secretly infiltrated that area. He was called to help the wounded. Look for him there. Thank you, Lara. Right near where my fucking base is. That's kind of convenient, actually. Oh, that's pretty. Uh, you, uh, drug addled guys, go about your business. Mm, I'm just gonna save it real quick. Save the game! Oh. Hey! I jumped over that! Whoa! And the game nearly exploded. It was not prepared for jump to do anything. Hmm. How does this lamp work? Is it full? I, I guess they fill the little thing with kerosene? That seems most likely. Ah, the dogs that are seemingly everywhere and yet nowhere. I think my character, Army Barak, is just like going mad. Just like, the dogs! The dogs! Just hears barking everywhere I go, but I never see any dogs in town. That's some trippy shit right there. What is, like, I feel like I'm in, like, Russian Silent Hill. Well, you know, that, there were mannequin people just before. It's seeming more and more plausible. Look at all the mist. They keep talking about a bone cannibal ass. Pretty sure they, uh, like, they just mean bone cannibals or cannibal, but whatever. Uh, just because, let's take a quick, uh, step in to see what's her face, Capella. Because, you know, sometimes she gives me the sweet hookup with those magic visions. While her father, that fat piece of crap, just gives me the runaround. Oh, I'll totally help you, motherfucker. Though I do appreciate him shielding me from being, you know, persecuted for murder. Letting me stay in his house and sleep in his child's bed. Recently, father avoids me. Recently, Father avoids you. Well, there you go. He's not a very good man. <laughs> ah, I just nudged my microphone. If you heard a... I actually just smacked my microphone while I was scratching my nose. It was, uh, it was pretty brutal. Uh, we'll go across this bridge and down there. That seems the most effective way. Oh! Do I have any razors? I have three. That'll, that'll buy me precisely dick from these guys. At best, maybe their Sergeant fucking Peppers over here will, uh, uh, will, like, you know, show me some of his sweet, awesome boxing technique. Like, guy's ability to generate power? Fucking ridiculous. Like, absolutely ridiculous. It just kills me with boxing. It's just, are, are you kidding me? Wait. Alright. Is this the entrance? Be the entrance. Oh, I gotta walk around. D <sighs> You win this round, fence. It would have been just as efficient to go down here and cross this bridge. Learn to climb fences, Artemy. I bet the bachelor knows how to climb a fucking fence. You know, actually, I bet he doesn't. I bet he's just as useless as you are. Huzzah! Success! Did 
place is kind of cool. Wow. That guy got fucked. Okay. What's the deal, dude? Why is your head way too small for your body? Okay, look, I, I understand. This is art, and this is, this is, you know, this is a game. It's a lot, uh, this actually looks like it's just photoshopped photos, what they d used for here. That, that's fine, right? It's been a lo long-standing thing that, you know, especially in older games, in RPGs, Neverwinter Nights, for example, the portrait is a bit different to the, uh, to the character's model, because, you know, it's, it's difficult to make, a uh, particularly the technology they had then, to make the character's model look like the portrait. However, this guy has hair down past his fucking chin. It's that is nearly at his shoulders. This guy looks like he just came out of the goddamn Marine Corps. That's not okay. At all. Alright. Rant over. Like, that's just fucking laziness. I can even forgive the mad scar across his nose here that he doesn't have. Uh, you're forgiven, okay? They told me that you took up the, the duty that you were making the panacea. That you are risking your life each hour. You're being hunted, just as I am. You're being hunted? I didn't know. You see, I am forced to hide. I've come here only because the shaver men wounded a person whom I owe. Yes, now I am an outlaw on the run. On the rum! I'm an outlaw on the run, and I have more ground to be called that than you. What have you done? It all got greatly mixed up. I've been told a strange story not long ago. I think you were being hunted for what I had done for Simon Kane. Yes, I've heard that Simon Kane is dead. You were attacked, remember, at the station. There were volunteers that were out on an ambush waiting for the killer. They thought he would try to escape and hide in one of the carriages until the regular train comes in. What have we got to do with it? I thought Oin and Dankonski found the truth that Simon's killer is still among us and there is no means to punish him right now. Oh. Yeah. Now we're being hunted by fanatics for the desecration of Simon's remains. Well, they are looking for me for what I had really done. When I understood what is in the blood of this superhuman, I decided to do something outrageous. I decided to make a remedy against the sand plague from Simon's remains. Why didn't you explain anything? Hell no! Explaining anything to the Canes is useless. Simon, Simon is a fetish for them. Right. They prefer to have faith in his name, his sacred power, and hell knows what else. There's a family of imperious esoterics, esoterics, sorry, esoterics, uh, esoteric, uh, who believe in no science except for sorcery. And what is a fetish? Uh, not really pertinent. Uh, you, you know, um, pertinent. Uh, Artemy, don't worry about it. Where have you been all these years? I thought you went away to stay in the West. I'm joking. It's strange to hear this word come out of your mouth. Continue. Can I count on you? That depends on what you're planning to do. What I have done already. I have desecrated him. I opened his body along all its lines and squeezed all the blood I could from it. I got the bacteria from it and made a few specimens for defensive vaccines. Old Simon fed mankind with himself once more. Did you look for antibodies in his blood? That was the first thing I did. There was nothing of the kind, you know. I am quite a skeptic, but each time I encounter the mystics of the Kane family, I'm filled with fear. The disease began to fade away with, with, uh, within him all on its own, but didn't die. What do you mean all on its own? His blood is of a different nature. It isn't quite human blood. I mean more than human blood. Do you understand? Not even a little! In any case, this blood is no more. I used all of it to make vaccines, but don't be sorry about it. I don't think it would help you anyway. Well, thank you for the news. Uh, it's it's a shame there isn't much more from help from them, and don't be angry with me, please. I don't like blind hatred, Stack. I wish you luck. You're gonna do something about these guys on the ground? Is this Simon Kane, the immortal? What's going on in the cemetery? Be careful. They're what? Digging pits? That's usually what goes on there. What Katharina Sabruva Sabruva say about me? She said that you are coming. She said that the first days you will spend away from everyone and that you will make a bloody sacrifice. Not too good, and you believed her? Of course, how can I not? She even said that you will drown the town in blood, quench the earth's thirst for blood, or let the rivers of blood flow. That is literally what she said. That could have been said as a metaphor. 
Yeah, those guys have been working around this place have spilt more blood in one day than one could imagine. Well, I'll speak to her. Anything cool over here? No? No? Alright. So, we got the corpse of a superhuman and the bodies of two guys who are blatantly wounded and, like, need of showers or something. Like, my god, dude! I came to help by standing here and watching them struggle and die in their last hours. Oh, Jesus! Well! That was... unexpected. Masks are playing a new pantomime at the theater. Oh, Christ. In fact, past 24 hours, 1184 people have gone missing. This is bullshit! That's some fucked up shit right there! You guys fucking blow! Fuck! And what's with this guy? Oh, Jesus. Well, that was interesting. Sup, dude? I'll get fucked! Fuck! <laughs> oh. That was some bad news bears right there. Alright guys, I'ma call it there. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Pathologic. Episode 40, the big 4-0. Uh, so yeah, as always, like, favorite, subscribe, leave a comment if you feel the need. And thanks for watching guys.